We got Street Shark right there. That's so cool. Guardians of the Galaxy set. We got a Voltron Lego set. Got some droids. That is awesome. What's up guys, Sleeping Collectibles here, Reppin is Into the AM merch, Into the AM slash sleeping for 10% off all, all your Into the AM needs. We're at Target here in Uniontown, PA, right over there. We're on our way to Toy Palooza in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. We're going to go to a nice little toy show today, we're going to try to pick up some goodies, and in the meantime, we got a little pee break, we need a, a little coffee break, we need a little toy break. So we go to Target, still looking for that Ultimate Edition Hulk Hogan, Ultimate 13, looking for some clearance goodies, looking for some Funko goodies. Halloween. No, no Halloween. Halloween. She's excited for Halloween goodies. I'm just here. Let's go inside. We got hot in the video. Let's go. I love the smell of a Target toy section in the morning. Mmm. Let's find those figures. All right, here we go. Wrestling land. See some Rey Mysterio, some Reckoning. Do have a few AEW. Nothing I really need though. It looks a lot like Peg Warmer City. Do have a reaction Leonardo hanging up in Star Wars land. And uh, no Landos, just Leia and Grief. Got some Greedo. Got some Hammond collection stuff. I'm not really seeing anything too interesting though. Do have a Parasaur Luff or blah, 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 blah. And a few other things hanging out here. But nothing amazing. Someone's gotta do some restocking though. Let's go over here. What do we got on this side of the world? Superman, Armored, and other soups. Not too much. Do have some Reaction Joes. Storm Shadow. There's a Gore, Siren, Vulcan. Business as usual. There's not anything too exciting here, honestly. No Page Punchers. No new wrestling. Nothing. Oof. We may have struck out here at Union Town Target. At least there's coffee and bathrooms. Let's keep looking around. There's a little end cap station here. A little Ragnarok action. I see a Ravager Thor. A bunch of dinos. It's another Ravager Thor in this cart. Some Mighty Thor. There's a little bit of stuff just kind of thrown everywhere. There's a Tanjiro boxes. There's our Xbox Stacy Keebler. Ooh, what is that? Is that. That is. That's... Oh, look how pretty that is. We got our manga spawn wondering how long it would be before I saw that. That looks great in person. Very, very cool. Have our Starro pieces down there. Uh, it looks like we have a little tiny Pokemon section down here. I see some Shining Fates. Some ETBs. A little, little NECA section. Uh, there's Rat King, Vernon, Frank. Both versions of Frank. And a little bit of Lego stuff. Let's go over to NECA. See what's going on over there. All right, we got those gremlins over here. Got some Batman Beyond. Do have that Alien Fire Team Elite. I like seeing new alien stuff at the shelves. Horror Neck is looking good. I see some clearance over here. Kyler Murray, Magic Johnson, Treat Yourself set. There's our Vision. There's a Cassian Andor. Little San Diego action. There's more Zola Vision, Asuka, Ronin. See some new Tokyo Ghoul stuff. Some Hawkeye stuff on sale. Some JP, Jurassic Park. It's my man Vince Carter. Looks like his Funko's kind of falling over a little bit. Explains why he's still on the shelf. He should have been gone the moment he was out. He's one of the better slam covers in my opinion. Some Twilight Zone reaction up there. There's a Biggie Smalls reaction. But I don't see too much else. Just hoping to find Blacklight Wanda. Oh, there's the Groot comic cover though. It's my first time seeing that. That's kind of cool. We may end up picking that up. Box is in decent shape too. Yeah, we might get Groot. That's kind of cool. He can go in my comic cover collection. Groot, you're coming home with me. I don't see too much else. There's our Thor Frog of Thunder. A couple clearance pieces here. There's our K Bishop pins. Yeah, I think we're pretty good. I think I'm gonna make last round or two and then probably get out of here, get going to that toy show. I'll see you guys soon. All right, guys, got a little clearance section over here. Some Star Wars pins. 
we got our 375 Batman here. I know matches Malone. We're looking at these 269 for movie ones. Penguin, Batman. Penguin looks phenomenal. I think the Batman looks a little rough around the edges. Uh, got some Battle World. There's a couple overpriced DC Multiverse. 1699 is a little bit too much for me. Got a Rayquaza. Got a Thresh from League of Legends. Uh, Mighty Morphin Ninjas for seven. 11 for Infinity Killmonger. I know that's seven dollars at a lot of places right now. And by 11, I mean 12. Doing some sleeping math. Eh, that really looks like it. We did find a Monica Rambo comic cover for four dollars. We're gonna pick that up along with the Groot, I believe. Chase Elliott Funko for three dollars. Some more of those Batman art series for seven. Comes in the hard stack too, which is nice. Uh, just not for me. I think I'm out on that. Two dollars for these Wanda moments. That's cool. I might end up picking up one of these. I don't know. All right, now I'm getting out of here. We have a toy show to go to. I can't go blowing all my money at Target. I'll see you guys soon. All right, guys, we're here. Toy Palooza, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. We're getting ready to go in right now. It's a lot of cars in the parking lot. Uh, I saw some of the pictures online of the tables, and there's a lot of good stuff here. I think uh, my wallet's gonna be very, very sad very soon. So I'll catch you guys on the inside. We gotta walk across this road to get in. I'll see you in there. All right, guys, we're inside. I see all the tables over there, all the vendors. Looks like a nice looking turnout up here. Let's get in, let's go buy some toys. All right, we are in guys. We are in Toy City, bros. I'm excited, my wallet's excited. Let's go see what we can get into. Right here. Got some Hasbros. See a lot of stuff that I'm interested in already. Look at Brody Chase. That's cool. Bubbly right there. Some Beast Wars Fireball Island. Bunch of Transformers up here. I know a few Transformers guys would be in heaven in this place already. Got our InSync dolls. Something Space Buns once. What's that? Those are cute. I dig it. All right, I see a big. Oh, it's my man Wrestling Crypt over here. Let's go see what Wrestling Crypt's got going on. He's always got the good stuff. Got that T2 Rock'em Sock'em Robot set. See our retros. We got some AEW. We got our Lionheart for 45. It's a good one. Got our chases up here. To sign Matt Hardy. Oh, Darby, there's Punk, Jungle Boy. A little Star Wars section over here. I'm noticing that a lot of the prices are a bit more inflated than usual, which isn't necessarily bad. I'm I'm all for everybody getting their money. A lot of things though that I probably wouldn't pull the trigger on, even though I really like the stuff. I did see some street sharks over there. I definitely want to check out before we leave. Space bums. Yeah, that Grievous for thirty five is a good price. I paid forty for mine. All right, let's keep going. Met a lot of great people here so far, and a lot of people have recognized me already as well. Gotten a few. Uh... Oh, look at that Halloween set over there. Gotten a lot of handshakes and high fives here. Recognize me from the channel. Hey guys, what's up? The All the Beetlejuice figures, those are okay, cool. I was looking at the Peanuts Halloween down there. All right, let's go see how much these are real quick. Some more WWE Elites here. Some really good ones. Jake. Some He-Man. Let's go over here and see what we got going on. I love bins of figures on the ground. One of my very favorite things, especially these Marvel Legends. We're definitely going to be going through there. <laughs> We've got a Logan, We've got a Ghostface, We've got some Transformers right here. We got a Bane, Batman, Adventures of Batman and Robin. We've got our NECA gargoyles up there. There's a signed Orange Cassidy for 120. Tons of good stuff here. We're gonna dig into this Marvel Legend bin right here. See if we can't come up with anything. Let's see what we got. On your wristband, it's awesome. I'm definitely adding something like Captain Carter. Suit Spidey, we have one of those. It's a lot of newer stuff. There's a Gamora for 28. That's in the maybe pile. I have been wanting to get more Guardians of the Galaxy stuff. 
not seeing anything else I really need. What is this? That's a good habit. That Gamora is a maybe though. We might come back for her. That could be a thing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright, let's keep wandering. Let's find a new booth. Let's see what we got here. Got some more Star Wars Black Series. A little gonk action right there. Got some sweet wood burning. We got Street Shark right there. That's so cool. Guardians of the Galaxy set. We got a Voltron Lego set. Got some droids. That is awesome. Got some Sectars over here. Some more Street Shark action up there. Got our Mezcos. Some Venom figures. Some Marvel Now things. Let's keep Batman. The street shark's awesome though. Very, very cool. Dig that a lot. All right, let's see what else we got. Let's keep moving. Let's get everything in we can. There's my man, Mabel. Bunch of WWE elites here. I like these old NXT boxes. All right, let's go find a new booth. Let's dive into some more. What's up, guys? Sleeping Collectibles. We're taking a break from the video. Got my man, Young JDR, right here. Listen, he doesn't need any more subs. He's got too many subs. But if you want to subscribe to him, tell him where they can find you. Young JD on YouTube. Road to 17K, baby. 17K. I gotta start playing Fortnite. I'm in the wrong business, guys. Oh, no, it's good to you, brother. Let's see, bro. All right, looking at a lot of booths, I've seen a few things that I want to pick up, but nothing I've committed to yet. My arms are still empty. Uh, we're definitely finding some things though. What about you guys in the comments section? Tell me, is there anything here you've seen that you'd be interested in getting? Should I have picked something up? Did I miss something? Do you like that Spider-Man right there? Guardians of the Galaxy sat with some chases up there, some Black Light Funko. A lot of wrestling and Motu. A lot of Transformers as well. It's a big toy show. Oh, look at that razor right there. How great is that? Ooh. Mm. That's an awesome figure. That has a terrible Roman Reigns. Look at that face. Oof. Got some droids. Got a vintage Star Wars right here. 95, it's not too bad for that. Let's go over here, let's have a look, see what's going on. Darby, Lance Archer. Everybody here has a Lance Archer chase. Must be the most common one, because every booth has them. Just hoping to find some CM Punk. I saw a Lionheart Jericho at that one table. Just hoping to find a Punk figure a little bit early, but not having any luck with that yet. Got some Cracked Bubble stuff. Some really cool figures though. It's an Empire Lego on card for 80, that's cool. Vader, a lot of cool stuff. Look at that Lost World Jurassic Park, 100% complete. Oh, that is so cool. If I had an extra six hundred laying around, that would be mine. All right, I'm wandering. Let's go make some purchases. Let's see what we can find. Some vintage TMNT up there. Some Street Fighter. Oh man, a bunch of Marvel Legends down here. Looks like a lot of newer stuff. Um, Nothing I really need. It's a red box Grievous. That's cool. All right, I'll be right back. Here we have the elusive space buns in their natural habitat. Looking at random items. Creature from the Black Lagoon. That's kind of rad. Got some Thundercats. Some Gundam. Some Mars Attacks figures, those are cool. I like this. Yeah, there's a Mars Attacks. Yeah, it's very cool. It's a lot of stuff here. Some vintage Star Wars, a lot of Millennium Falcons here. Saw a Death Star. Seen a lot of TIE Fighters, some Imperial Attack bases. There's definitely some stuff here for you to spend your money on. If you guys are looking for a toy show in the Western Pennsylvania area, I cannot recommend Toy Palooza enough. Awesome. All right, so Space Buns made her for first purchase of the con. She got an Emily Corpse Bride Funko Pop. I just picked up that Super 7 Robin Hood Prince John for 30. Such a great deal. Couldn't let it sit for 30 bucks, not at all. All right, let's get some more things. 
Let's, uh, I love these Simpsons figures. I kind of want to snatch one or two of them up. I had a feeling. They might, they might end up becoming, they might end up coming home with me, honestly. Some of them at least. They're very, very cool. Kyle's around here too, somewhere, shopping. This vintage G.I. Joe Mewtwo. Man, there's so much good stuff here. Vintage Star Wars. Really? Oh, Got some Gunpla, some Transformers. Got some Lego. Got, got some Pokemon out here. A lot of Pokemon here, which is really cool to see. I feel like I don't get to see as much of that anymore, these kind of shows, as it falls in and out of style, I guess. In and out of fashion, as they would say. There's Pterodon, that's cool to see. Some TMNT. Hot Toys Batman. All right, let's go buy some things and get out of here. What a good show. All right, guys, all done at Toy Palooza. Uh, bought a couple things, nothing too crazy. We got a Marvel Legend, we got a Super 7 figure. Currently at Target in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Gonna go in, look for the same things we've been looking for. That Ultimate Hogan's still number one on the list. Really wanna find that. So we'll go in, we'll see what we got. And uh, you guys are coming with me. You guys like my backpack. Yeah, I always got you on my back. Let's go. All right, guys, here in the toy section, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Target. Uh, I do see some LOL dolls I might snatch up for my daughter. Her birthday's coming up soon. Definitely interested in that for her. Let's get over here to, wow, there are a lot of people here. Let's see if we can't get over to the action figures without running into too many folks. Here we go. Actually, let's go over one more. Nope, just kidding. Let's go back over here. Oof, tough, tough, tough. Do have Eject, do a Bulkhead, Coronation Starscream. We got 50% off a lot of this Batman stuff. 70% off up there. That's cool to see. Titan Joker, it's Clayface. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of good deals to be had on DC right now. Do see some gore over here. We got our Groot. A lot of tags for 70% off right now. Uh, movie Joes, some 375 Joes. Oh, we got adorables. See some pop pins, some more Funko Pops. There's some wrestling over here. Got a bunch of Batista. Of course we do. No Hogan. I wish. Santana, Ortiz, Reckoning. Got some Landos. We do have Obi-Wan Kenobi, Darth Vader, 375. That's cool. It's the first time I've seen that. Dig that. I'm looking for six inches though. I'm trying to stay out of 375 the best I can. You see some Funko over here. We got Throg. Got some Doctor Strange comic covers. Got our Ronin sets. See some clearance here on this end cap. Our Rock Cena is only 17. That's a great price for that. Got some pins. Some more clearance down here. Everything's so spread out. Some more pins. Dooku, Harry Potter, that kind of stuff. Well. This is kind of chaotic, I'm not going to lie. Do see some Fortnite figures over here. Love that one. There is a Fortnite chase. It's kind of fun to find. If you can locate it, it sells for a couple bucks. And it's kind of cool to have, honestly. Let's go over and look at it. There's a Nerf right here. What's down here? Looks like just swimming. All right, I'll be back. All right, guys, we're here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania at Target. Checking our shelves, checking our pegs, seeing if we can't find anything cool. And I just found something awesome underneath of this shelf right here. Uh, check this out. Lift this guy up right here. <laughs> and look at that. We have a mud Mandalorian in this dust garbage right here. Star Wars Black Series. Look at that stuff on it. I love checking underneath shelves in towns I've never been to. You find people's old stashes. I'm gonna clean this up and see if it rings up any cheaper. Let's go to the price scanner. All right, so we took this over to the price scanner and it is not turned on. So I asked that employee over there who told me that it would be $36. So for $36, he can hang out right there. Later days, let's keep moving. All right, we stopped at this mall on the way home and we actually found this place called New Dimension Comics here in Pittsburgh. We're gonna drop in so we see some toys in the back. See you guys in a second. All right, inside this comic store is a nice little toy section. We've got some Alien vs. Predator, we got Battle Damage Alien Queen, 
We got some Super 7 action, some Predators. So you got Toonie Terror, some King Kong, Frankenstein, Starlight, uh, Dark Carnival figures. I know those were really popular for a while. Got Ray's Speeder. How much is that? $60. There's a lot of Black Series here. We got Zero. We got Grief. We got a lot of Red Box stuff up here, which is really cool to see. Uh, got some giant size turtle over here. Got some 50% off DC Multiverse stuff down here. That's kind of cool. Uh, what we got over here? Got our He-Man. We got our Masters of the Universe. Giant size turtle up there. Do see some, a couple Transformers. Nothing too crazy. See some Tron. Some Power Ranger Lightning Collection. Some Green Lantern. Some Batman Adventure stuff. That's kind of cool. Oh, I love the Watchmen. This is cool couple great Watchmen sets here. It looks like $50 each. Bunch of DC Multiverse stuff. Looks like a lot of commons. Nothing that we really need. Batman Animated Series Two-Face. That is cool. I like that a lot. Somebody's helping themselves to a Batman over there. On this side, we got a bunch of Marvel. Oh, we have the X-Jet sealed in box for $80. That is cool. I had that when I was a kid. It's one of my favorite toys when I was younger. Oh, we got a Wolverine, we got a Domino, we got our Wasp, we got our What If figures here. It's uh, Professor X, Marvel Legends with Galactus Head. It's the price on that, 40 bucks for that. Uh, I got Grey Hulk, 40 bucks. See thing. There's our X Men movie figures down there at the bottom. Some older Marvel Legends like that, Doctor Strange. It's a uh, Cranky Jean. Look how narrow her face is. Oof. Emma Frost, there's no Professor X, Black Widow with the bike, Modoc. Uh, Toxic Crusaders reaction figures. Those are rad. Uh, some Funko Gold. Some G.I. Joe classified. It's all movie stuff, though, and a flint. I do like these Super Cyborg Cobra bats. Those look awesome. Uh, some Peanut Super 7. Some Scooby-Doo down here. Those are kind of cool for 30 bucks. I dig those. Some Cobra Kai figures. Uh, I got some books over here. Got some Wild Space Buns. Uh, some Buffy. Some Muppets. Some Avatar some ICP and then we get into our Marvel Select stuff and they do have that new watcher up there how great that figure looks I really dig that I might end up picking that up for me I really like how that looks uh, Psylocke Wolverine is Punisher Cap Marvel Cyclops Magneto it's Cap America Hawkeye Beast Thanos they have a few great pieces here Iron Giant how cool that is love the Iron Giant Hercules yeah, honestly, I think we're good, though. If anything, I might buy that watcher. I might hold off, too. I don't know. I'm on the fence. I think we're getting ready to get out of here. Get moving to our next destination. I'll see you guys soon. Found this new figure end cap here. The Ghost of Starscream. We have Bonsai Tron from Super 7. Those are really cool. Uh, we got Wolverine, Havoc. Up here, we have Maggot, Sabretooth. We got Killmonger. It's in that new Legacy Black Panther. Uh, the Cobra Kai VHS Diamonds up here blimp it's a lot of cool stuff at this place it's amigo batman beyond very very rad all right we're getting out of here i don't think i'm gonna spend any money in here it's very cool to see a lot of this stuff let's go on to the next stop all right on the way back home now we're currently in Jeanette, pennsylvania we're at target again uh i gotta get toys back i still haven't found that old Ten hogan i'm looking for so we're stopping to look for that also gonna look for some more clearance deals we i didn't show it on camera but the last uh, last target we actually scooped up some mini brand supermarkets for four dollars. They're originally forty, so easy win. I'm gonna give one to my daughter. Maybe put the other one on mine for sale. I don't know. But right now we're in Target. We got stuff to look for. Let's go. All right, we're walking through the toy aisles, and I actually just found this Hey Hey sitting on the shelf. And Hey Hey's coming with me. As I've said in numerous videos, I love Moana. Hey Hey's mine. Also, we have Galen Urso here. What is with that face, Galen? What is going on with that five o'clock shadow of yours? I don't know how I feel about that. He's in the maybe pile. Do have Nyla Rose, Anna Jay, some Dark Order stuff. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that Galen Urso face. It looks a little rough around the edges. I might still get it. We'll see. Do you have these Star Wars Squadron figures? I do like these a whole heck of a lot. Got that TIE Fighter right there. Got that, that Ventress Starfighter. These look phenomenal. TIE Advanced, no Jedi Starfighter. Those look great. There's no Hogan here, as you guys have seen. No, Hogan. 
Let's get around to the other side. Let's see what's going on over there. All right, over here, Transformer Land. We don't really have much. A lot of the same stuff we've seen at all the other targets we've been to. Do you have that Robin? That's kind of cool. I have not seen that Robin. It's missing his leg. Had an unfortunate accident, it looks like. Got our Hush 2 pack. Super 7 Joes. Do have our Black Panther Marvel Legend. Might actually get this. I don't have a Black Panther. I may end up getting this legacy one. Uh, see Siren. See a few other little odds and ends, but nothing we need to have, honestly. Not a ton going on here. Over here in Pokemon Land, we got a multi packs. Got some little odds and ends. Do have a Fortnite mask? I've never seen a fade mask. It's new for me. Uh, got some figures. Let me check these, see if there's any chases here. Uh, a buddy of mine found one, and it actually, oh man, I'm just knocking everything over. It actually looked kind of cool. I was kind of into it for a minute. Let's put these back up. Let's go slide over to NECA Collectibles and see what they got over there. All right, dropping into NECA Collectibles. We got our Tundra and Nezco. We got our Fugitoid. Got our Jurassic Park bags. Got some Funko here. Some Jurassic Park. These Stranger Things figures on clearance for 20 bucks. It's interesting. I'm keeping an eye on those. I might be interested if they get any cheaper than that. Uh, look at the Funko. Just seeing if there's anything we need. So far, I do not see anything. Rintra. We got down here. Some NECA TMNT, there's our Bronx, our Demona. Uh, Nosferatu. Down here we got some trading cards, I see some Pokemon. Nice Pokemon restock, holy cow. That is real nice. A little bit of everything here. Don't see anything we need though. Looks like business as usual for the most part. Space Bunch, you find anything? It's Pokemon Go ETB, there's Jack. All right, I'm gonna wander around, make a second and third pass, see if there's anything here that I missed. I'll catch up with you guys in a second. Sadly, hey, hey has to stay here. I just scanned him at the price scanner and he's $22. And that is entirely too much for this hey, hey. So I'm sorry, brother. You must remain at Target. Let's keep looking. One more Target before we head home. We're in Greensburg, PA. Uh, literally like five miles away from the last Target. Gonna go in, still looking for Ultimate Hogan. Looking for good clearance pieces. Looking for anything that excites me. I have most everything I could want right now, I think. Uh, except for Saul Guerrero. I picked up a Saul Guerrero Black Series and I saw one. But we'll see. We'll see what we can find. You never know Target. Distribution's so wild. Could be anything in here. Let's find out. Alright guys, we found a toy section. Now are we going to find any toys that we want? That is the million dollar question. This is one of those Targets with a toy section on the right hand side. Always unusual to see one like that. But, you know how it is sometimes. I uh, see some AEW. Let's go check that out real quick. See some more Galen. I see a Saw Gerrera. All right, me likes. Me likes a lot. Do see John Silver, Lance Archer, Lance Archer, John Silver, Lance, Brody. The longer that this wave is out, the more Brody Lee's I'm seeing on the shelf. Do see one Saw Gerrera. I may end up getting Saw. I do like that a lot. We might pick up Saw Gerrera. What a good looking figure did say in the parking lot that I would pick one up if I saw it. Don't see any WWE Ultimates though. I was really hoping to find Hogan. Disappointing that I'm not finding it. We'll keep looking though. You guys know how it goes. Do see some good deals on some dinosaurs. Do see that para. See some Buzz Lightyear stuff. Some clearance stuff over here. Uh, do got some message figure arts. Dragon Ball Z right here. Do see some shelving here. It's a little bit on the lighter side. I'm going to go ahead and lay this stuff down for a few moments. Just have a peek. Nothing. There's nothing under there worth my time. Uh, Charlotte Flair gets Pokemon pencil cases. I hear those hey hey chickens over there. Uh, nothing over here on this side. Check the other side, see if there's any marble in there. All right, we do have a little section over here. Uh, some Beyblade. Do see a Metalhead. Do see our Siren, Vulcan. Eh, not seeing much, honestly. No, there's really not a ton, guys. You guys are seeing this. It's a lot of the same old same, honestly. This section right here looks a little light. I may check underneath real fast just to see if there's anything here. And there's not. I think we might be done this toy hunt. 
I'm gonna look for a NECA section, see if there's anything cool going on, and uh, maybe do one or two less quick passes through, just to see if I can't find anything. But I think we're pretty beat. Uh, I'll check in with you guys in a few minutes. What's up, guys? Finally home. What a long day this was. We left this morning at like 7 a.m. to go to Pittsburgh. We just got back. It's like 9.30 right now. I'm beat. All day, toy show, Target, Walmart, a little bit of everywhere, honestly. Got a ton of stuff. I want to show it off quick. And then I'm going to take a little nappy nap because I'm tired. Uh, first things first. At Target, you saw, we picked up that Saw Gerrera. Star Wars Black Series Deluxe figure. Needed him in the collection. I'm really glad I ran into him. This was on the I need to find list, so excited about that. At Target, we also picked up a Captain Marvel Monica Rambeau on clearance for $4.99. For that price, this comic cover, easy grab. Had to come home. We also picked up, off camera, a couple of these mini brand Supermarket Series 3. Uh, they were on clearance for $8.99, but when I took them to the register, they rang up for 5 bucks each, so I got two. One I'm going to give to my daughter for her birthday. The other one might go on my uh, eBay store. I don't know. That's kind of cool. I dig it. Also, today at Target, earlier this morning actually, feels like forever ago at this point, picked up that Groot comic cover as well. Going to go over there. I have a whole stack of comic covers just beyond camera. Excited about this Groot. He looks phenomenal. Going to put him there. At the con the toy palooza the toy show i did pick up that jessica jones let me go and take that 50 dollar sticky note off jessica jones marvel legend i love those netflix shows luke cage jessica jones daredevil they're all phenomenal they're so good and i'm really glad to have this one on the line i got barenthal punisher i need to get the daredevil to go with this but i'm glad jessica's here personal favorite of mine love it love it love it love it we also picked up that Robin Hood Prince John Super 7. And this piece may be my favorite piece of the day. Uh, everything about this figure just pops. It's so fantastic. From the packaging, look at that. Look how great that looks. To the figure itself. All of it just looks phenomenal. Look how great that is. And we've got Hiss down there. I love this figure. It displays well. The packaging is perfect. The price point was good. I got it for $30 off the table. Can't beat this for $30. Bucks. It sells all day for $50 online. So when he told me $30 takes it out the door, absolutely had to be mine. Very excited to have picked it up. It was a good day. Uh, Space Bones also picked up a uh, Corpse Ride Funko Pop as well today. It's upstairs. I didn't bring it down with me. Uh, it's going in her collection, so... That was it. We had a great day. It was a great toy con. I went with my friend. I went with Space Buns. We had a good time. Ran into some great people. I ran into my buddy Mike. Ran into young JDR, who you guys saw a little clip of there. Definitely go show JDR some love. Uh, great guy. Really fun channel over there. He's wonderful. You'll love him, I promise. Good times. Uh, gonna settle down this week for the most part. Gonna hit some targets, Walmarts, do the normal business. Next week we'll be at Steel City Con in Pittsburgh. If you're going... You see me, come say hello. I will be there at Steel City with Space Buns. A lot of big stuff planned. Uh, hopefully going to get a live stream in soon. It's been so, so busy lately. Uh, I appreciate all of you guys for hanging out, for watching, for being a part of this. Definitely going to have a live stream. Going to talk to everybody and catch up very, very soon. Uh, got merchandise down here in the shelf. And you go to this, the video description at the bottom. Got t-shirts you can order. You can also go to Into the AM slash Sleeping. You get 10% off any Into the AM merch that your little heart could desire. Uh, th that company's been phenomenal to me. I love them. And that's pretty much all I got going on right now. Business as usual for the most part. Got a lot more toy room stuff to do. I've actually moved around a bunch of stuff. I'm going to give a complete toy tour very, very soon. So be excited for that. Uh, I'm done talking though. I'm tired. I'm going to take a nap. So I will see you guys soon. Good night. Sleep tight. I hope all your collecting dreams come true. Blah, 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 blah. Later days. Have a good night, guys. Bye.